will a cattail filter pond water? Let's find out. Get off, there you. So I saw this video and I was like, you know what? I got a pond with tails. Let me give it a let me give it a shot. This little trash bottle. Cut this off so I can collect some water. That's mini. Let's go get us some water. Yeet. Nope. <laughs> Hard to do this with one hand. <laughs> Yeet. Yeah, let's get some of that. See if we can get some of that water. Uh, how much water we get? None. <laughs> yes. All right. Uh, I guess it was a little bit. Oh, I suck at this so bad. I'm so bad at this. There we go. Ugh. Come on. Get some water in there. Water's too far away for me to just go get some. Let's see if we can get some more. Got yeah, a little bit, but we need some, would like some more. There we go. There we go. That's gonna be a good amount. That'll do. <clears throat> Not super murky, but let's go. Let's go see how it works for science. See how gross that is. Water's coming. Water's coming through. I don't know if it's so much better. I don't know. Can you see that in there? I guess we'll come back and see if there's a noticeable difference or anything or something. Little update. <laughs> just can't tell if it's really that much better or not. It definitely has a lot of the sediment is not there. So maybe that's a positive. You see all that sediment right there. That So maybe that's, maybe that's the takeaway. We'll, but we'll, there's still some in here. We'll let it finish and then we'll, we'll critique. All right. So that's pretty much it. Let's put it, let's put this up here for a comparison. It's a little clearer, but no sediment, so that's good. That's a positive, at least. I would still definitely boil this and put some iodine in it, but at least they got the sediments out in it. I guess, I guess it's a little clearer. I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs>